for the zombie fish. Lindsay Beth Goddard is a very versatile horror writer. She's had a handful of works published, lots of stories accepted into magazines, and claims to be battier than a Texas cave. Released in 2012, Quick Fix A Taste of Terror is a very short anthology, only 67 pages, cut up over five stories, but I feel the title perhaps doesn't do it justice. It gives it a bit of a, a disposable feel, like a hot dog, when this is actually much closer to a good steak. Just the five tales on offer here, but there's quite a bit of variety. The first one is probably the most like real life, arguably the hardest hitting. The last one is along the lines of fantasy, and whereas the middle three are straight out of science fiction, but they're all bound by Lindsay's unique and elegant style of writing. The author definitely likes her finer descriptions, from reflections off of bottles, to the character of trees during sunsets, the kind of indulgent passages that will easily fall apart in less capable hands, but it's readily apparent with each of these tales that Lindsay knows exactly what she's doing. There are some cool descriptions in here. Nothing overly nasty, more so the kind that just bring a smile to the face, like the scuttling of overgrown cockroaches sounding like nails tapping on a table. There's even sentiments of love and companionship shoved in here, which is quite skillful given the very short length of these. The coolest concept was probably in the second tale, Product 9, where there was quite a satisfying sense of story or even story progression, quite skillful in just 10 pages or more. My favourite though would have to be the first, Hair of the Dog, which has quite a unique and disturbing ending. With the prevalence of Kindles these days, I believe it's reduced the worth of writing. I've seen people complain if they have to pay more than a few quid unless it's of a certain length. But this just underlines a key rule with most things in life, which is quality over quantity any day. And for less than the price of some crappy Starbucks coffee, you can treat yourself here to some quality spooky tales. I'm going to give Quick Fix A Taste of Terror a very respectable 4 out of 5 goat skulls.